you never know until you try and you're never going to be free unless you try. Hi everyone, welcome back to All About The Muddy. This video is Kelly Clarkson, Mr. Know-It-All and let's get into it. I like the guitar, and holy crap, that's a lot of articles on her. But I like that they use it as the background because nowadays people don't really read the paper. They have so, um, updates on their phone. couple lines sticks out to me because if you've read the Harry Potter series, you know that Hermione gets put as inseparable know-it-all by Snape in the first year just because she's so smart. But there's also like some people who like think they know it all but they don't know it all and I would be one of those cases, especially when I'm defiant. So, yeah. And then y'all, people say y'all in like southern parts they did it when we lived in texas a lot and yeah I like that this song she's telling the person or the guy that he's not going to tell her how it's going to go or any of that, that she's making that up for herself. And that's what I like because I don't like, as I've said, to rely on people and I'm not, I don't want to rely on a guy either. Like I'll rely on my dad, fine, but even then it's like, it's a little complicated. <laughs> And then don't you know that I lead, not follow. My dad is pretty big on be a leader, not a follower. Like make your own path rather than follow one that's already made. So that sticks out to me. You don't have the right to tell me like anything because you don't know and that's like not your place and I feel like there's a difference between like suggesting and full-on like demanding and some people cross that You don't know a thing about me so like for me personally I don't really show who I am at first like I'll stick to reading a book or just being really quiet I'm more of an introvert and I hate going places with people I hate it if I'm around people I know sure but if I'm like in a room full of people I don't know like freshman orientation was so scary because it was all people I didn't know um, but even then it's like my friends have to really get to know me to know who I am I'm just I don't like full on expressing it I'm more of like hide it but I've gotten better at like expressing myself loud louder I guess you could say I don't know if that makes sense but we're gonna go with it Okay, this is gonna sound really cliche because this is like how every breakup song I've listened to is. 
is either like the guy screwed up or the girl screwed up and they're the other one's thinking oh they're gonna come back and then they don't come back and it's like I messed up I feel like that's how every love song is now but I that could just be me that's why I feel like in this situation, maybe the guy like stereo stereotyped her to be like a certain type of girl, and she's like, "I'm not that girl." But I could be wrong. At least that's what I'm thinking. Probably because we're doing a lot of stereotype stuff in my classes. Yeah. But I like it. I have never heard of Mr. Know It All before today. I had to search it up because one of you guys suggested to listen to more of her album. And I did it, and I really like it. I'm not used to her with brown hair. Like, I'm used to her with blonde and black hair. So this is new, but I like it. Her voice has gotten, like, I feel like she's progressed a lot over time, but her voice even then was, like, full-on powerful, and that's crazy. She has a very powerhouse-like voice, and I like it. I like that she can hit high notes, but she can also, like, go softer. I like how she can do multiple things, and she's very pretty. Cause baby, you don't know a thing about me You don't know a thing about me You ain't got the right to tell me When and where I go, no right to tell me Acting like you want me later Yeah, baby, you don't know a thing about me You don't know a thing about me The line that I don't really understand is acting like you owe me. For this song, I thought it would be the other way around, acting like Kelly owes the guy. But it it's okay. I'll get over it soon. That's confusing to me. Because if the guy owes her, why would she be writing the song? I don't know. I'm confused. This was Kelly Clarkson, Mr. Know-It-All, and I really liked it. I hope I said enough for you guys because I wasn't sure if I was going to have anything to say. But this is also a poem of the week video, so I'm going to get the poem pulled up. Found it. It says, She was a lost bird in an endless sky, but when she spread her wings, she remembered how to fly. And it's by At. Atticus, I think is how you say it. Um, this one I really like because I wrote a poem about a similar situation. Except in my case, my branch was going to snap and I have to learn how to fly after that. And so this is just a constant reminder of you never know until you try and you're never going to be free unless you try. So I like it and I hope you guys do too. And I'll see you guys next video. Bye everyone.